So I had a patient scheduled for surgery in November 2019 and it was just prior to his surgery that I saw Andrew's email and thought this is fantastic and spoke to the patient who was very willing to try the, uh, the new rib graft and so we performed the surgery in the end of November. I performed a huge amount of uh, autogenous costal cartilage grafts because I do a lot of ear reconstruction so I'm very comfortable with using rib cartilage for all sorts of both nasal and ear reconstruction. I was aware that in the US it was being used widely and I was very excited to try it for the first time here. Technically I found using the cartilage was exactly the same as using native rib cartilage uh, which I've as mentioned before, got a big experience with, so I'm very comfortable with using and what that feels like to carve, and I found no difference at all. Uh, if anything, I found it an advantage knowing exactly how much I was going to be able to get with the variable sizes that you can pre-order. I think there's a lot of benefits. I think, firstly, there's benefits for the patient, so there's, there's the benefits of less pain, less scar on the chest, less potential deformity from harvesting their own rib cartilage, uh, which means a greater recovery period. Um, and less associated risks with that, uh, which are of benefit for the surgeon. So whilst unlikely, there's always a small risk of pneumothorax when you're taking out a rib, there's a risk of infection, there's another scar on the chest, which you can have all the associated problems with surgery of infection, bleeding, hematoma, chronic pain, uh, etc. Uh, and I think the ease of, of use is great. I think it saves operative time as well, which is of benefit to both patient and surgeon. And the other one is often that the rib cartilage is a little unpredictable as to how calcified it can be because I have had patients where I've opened up their chest and found that the rib that I wanted to use was calcified and I've then had to slide down to another rib which can be a little tricky when you're trying to maintain a small incision. Uh, so there's a lot of benefits. I'd highly recommend it to fellow plastic surgeons. I think that people that aren't used to taking rib cartilage graft can be a bit daunting um, and I think removing that technical difficult part of the, the operation, having something that's available off the shelf uh, really makes it easy and I think for the patients the benefit is also there as well so I'd have no hesitation in recommending it.